There is controversy in the Forest Hills Northern School District tonight over an event planned by the school's Black Student Union. Spirit Week is scheduled to start on Tuesday and includes a Hoodie Day Trayvon Martin Day. 13 on your side's Micah Cho joins us now with the story. Juliet, the principal of Forest Hills Northern, told me that the week is meant, even that specific day, was meant to give students accessibility and get them engaged during the week, while some parents believe the week promotes some stereotypes. The purpose behind Spirit Week was to try to get students, in, and this is from our, our students' perspective, to try to get them engaged and then choose things that they really enjoy doing and that's very accessible and easy for them to throw on in the morning. Forest Hills Northern Principal Amena Moyes is addressing the controversy behind her school's Black Student Union Spirit Week. Parents originally heard that the school was having a Black History Month Spirit Week, but Principal Moyes says she misspoke with the actual name of the week being Black Student Union Spirit Week. One of the days that was picked by the Black Student Union, Wednesday's Hoodie Day slash Trayvon Martin Day. Principal Moyes says, the day is meant to honor and celebrate Trayvon Martin. She said she personally saw the week's spirit day schedule that she had to and did approve. It's a perspective. So many of our students of color have to think twice about what they're wearing, depending on where they're going, how they're going to be perceived. And it's just a different type of perspective to open up to all students to try to get them to kind of understand where some of our students of color may be coming from. Forest Hills Northern parent Annie Coughlin says when she first saw the Spirit Week schedule, it raised some questions. I think if they wanted to celebrate his life and commemorate it, you know, maybe there should have been some more explanation that went along with it. Coughlin adding she believes that the Spirit Week could have been handled differently. The, the Trayvon Martin Day did stand out, but just the other things that seem like stereotypes um, you know, and, and have historically been viewed as stereotypes. You know, I was a little put off by that. Like, how is this celebrating black history? Principal Moy says the day isn't necessarily an homage to black history, but getting students engaged and giving them accessibility when it comes to Spirit Week. Clocklin, however, sees the oversight issue differently. People of older generations, I mean, not to say that, you know, we as parents are old, but you know, we don't see things the same way our kids might, and maybe there needs to be some sort of, you know, generational talks between children and parents. Principal Moy stands behind the week. That's correct. Yep. Uh, we are moving forward with what we planned with our students. Correct. We re reached out to different people in the Forest Hills community for their response and haven't heard back, but it is also worth noting that the district did send an email to parents addressing the Spirit Week as well. Uh, reporting in the newsroom, Micah Cho, 13 on your side.